Right, what we're going to show you here today is how to soften your classic car leather interior. You're going to need LRC 20 leather softening cream and the LRC pad to do that. You're going to massage the solution into the leather. You can cover the leather with like a plastic or cling film so that it sort of sweats into the leather, which is going to create the, you know, making the leather surface nice, soft and supple. Once we've done that, we can then carry on with the full process of the restoration that we're going to do. Let's just get some gloves on to begin with. Um, I, I do actually massage this in with my bare hands, to be fair. Um, but obviously, we're putting gloves on. You know, some people that are, you know, do this may need gloves on so that it doesn't flare up any skin conditions or anything like that. So give the bottle a shake. Use the pad. Apply some on there. And literally just... Smother it on, that's all you're gonna do. Just get that smothered on and get it rubbed into the leather and it's gonna make it nice and soft and supple again, putting in all the goodness back into the leather. Once that's done, as I say, you can, you know, this, this can take sometimes a several week process or a several day process, depending on how brittle and how sort of hard the leather is, but just keep applying that and it does make such a huge difference. There's no, hard and fast rule about how soft, you know, how thick or thin you put it on. Because if you put cling film on it so it can sweat in, obviously the thicker the better because it will just sweat into it and make the leather really lovely and soft again. I mean, this leather is really dried out on this Jaguar, so I'm putting in quite a fair bit and also trying to rub it in to the leather as well, almost sort of forcing it into it so it goes into all the pores and soaks in. And you can see it soaking in there. Just literally carry on doing the full thing. As I say, you can put cling film around it or put it in a black like bin bag or something like that. Um, I'll get a bin bag in a second and I'll show you, you know, what we're gonna do with it. And I'll show you how to do that as well. So I'm just going to leave that for a couple of seconds. I'm going to let this video carry on running. I'm going to leave that for a couple of seconds to soak in. Then I'm going to put another coating on there. And then I'm going to actually put it in the bag. So let's just leave that there soaking for a couple of seconds. And we're going to leave that just to soak for this time being. So hopefully that's soaked in enough. I'm going to give it another sort of coating again before I put it in the bin bag. So let's give it another good rub in. You can see here where it's sort of soaking in and drying up. You can literally see here where it's drying up again, where it's soaked right into the leather. So, and again, you can see it all drying up here. So you know it's doing its thing and it's working itself into the leather beautifully, which is going to soften it and make it really lovely, soft and supple again. Let's get a real good coating on here. When you put the bin bag on, you can seal it. Obviously, is what you want to do. You either tie it up or seal it up with tape because what you don't want is any air getting in and this product to dry up. So you want it to be soaked on it so it can literally sweat into the leather and it will really make the leather soft and beautiful again and silky smooth. So when the, you recolour the item, you know, when you restore the colour, you've got that really beautiful brand new leather feel that's beautiful soft and smooth so let's just give it a real good coating and then i'm gonna put it in the bag i'll show you what we mean you can put it as i say wrap it in plastic cling film or anything like that i always put them in a black bin bag most of the time and that's the easiest way around doing it so let's have a look at that now and get that in the bag you can sort of see on the surface there how much it's got on it. So you need to really let it soak in there. And then what we're going to do is get that in the bin bag, like so. And bring it around and literally cover that over and we'll tape that up to there. And that's it. So you get it on there beautifully like that. 
And then we're going to tape this bottom round and we'll probably put another bag on the bottom there and that would be it. And that's how you would have it. And you literally have it on the bin bag, push the bin bag down like so, so it's got all the air out of it, like that. Make sure there's no air in there, push all the air out and that will sweat in to the leather, making it beautiful, soft and supple once again. So there's my red LRC pad used and LRC 20 leather softening cream and the red pad, as you can see, clearly used. So those are the two items that you would use to soften the leather in your classic car interior.